This is the sixth video in our series looking at how we set up and configure a Google Nest Wi-Fi mesh network. While we now have a fully working wireless mesh network, if we have a house guest who wishes to use our internet connection, due to the way that we set up Google Nest Wi-Fi, if we allow that guest to connect their own device to our wireless network, that device can see and potentially access any devices that we've connected to our home network. While you may not perceive this as an issue, if our guest device is infected with malware or viruses, because they have been given access to our primary wireless network, their device could spread infections to other devices on our home network. So in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can easily set up a guest wireless network, which will give our guests access to the internet, but isolate their device from devices connected to our primary home network. First, we need to open the Google Home app. As you can see, the devices that make up our Google Nest Wi-Fi network are displayed within the app. At the top of the Home panel, you will find a Settings icon. If we select this icon, we are taken to the Home Settings panel. Under Features, we have an option called Nest Wi-Fi. When we select this option, we are taken to the Primary Network panel. If we now select the option called Guest Network, we can enable and configure a wireless guest network. Let's toggle on our guest network. We're now prompted to give our guest network an easy to identify name. When we select Next, we're asked to give our guest network a password. When we select our password, we need to make sure that the guest password is at least eight characters in length. By selecting Save, our new guest Wi-Fi network will be created. Let's log out of the Google Home app and check that we can connect a device to our new guest wireless network. If from our smartphone we open Settings and then choose Wi-Fi, we should find that our smartphone automatically detects our new guest wireless network. If we try and connect to our guest network, once we are connected, as this device is now isolated from the devices in our primary network, we simply need to check that we can still access the internet. So to summarize, in this video, we took a look at how you create a wireless guest network in Google Nest Wi-Fi. We then tested that we could connect a device to our wireless guest network and that we could still access the internet. In the next video in this series, we're going to take a look at how we can perform an internet speed test from our Google Nest Wi-Fi router.